Oh. Hello you two, Sentinel H here for I guess episode 7.1 uh, extras video for my Reactor Craft series. So after I posted the video about uh, the terrible nuclear disasters, uh, Reiko made a comment uh, suggesting that I irradiate an Thoundcraft aura node. Um, and was it gave no further information about what would happen, so we're going to do just that. So I've placed a uh, an aura node here. I've got my goggles of revealing, so I can see it. I am in creative mode. I've placed a spent fuel container. I'm going to put uh, nuclear fuel in it. Uh, it I mean waste in it. Uh, it's going to explode. Uh, hopefully, it doesn't blow up the aura node. But if it does, I'll just place a new aura node. Yeah, it didn't blow it up. Okay, so this area is irradiated now. I don't know what's um, supposed to happen. We'll just leave the nuclear fuel sitting uh, waste sitting there, just for a little bit more radiation. Reika said to give it a minute, um, so we're going to, I guess, watch this aura node, and we're going to see if something. Well, we're going to see what happens. Something's going to happen. That's, I know that much. Question is, what will happen? Do 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 waiting. What can we talk about all the ways? I don't know. Don't do this. <laughs> it's probably a good a good bit of advice. Um not really sure what's supposed to be happening. I assume this uh, that the ore node itself is now irradiated, that explosion occurred directly underneath it. Let's just grab some. Oops. Let's pick up those goggles. So we can put the radiation goggles on and we can see that, yeah, we're. There's definitely radiation here. Oh! There we go. Something has occurred. Um. Oh! Yep, something's definitely happened. Let's go ahead and grab a cheat sheet thamanomicon. And we see what we've got. So it looks like our aura node now has uh, poison, death, entropy, um, aurum, for some reason, it's got an aura, uh, vidium, which is uh, taint. And uh, potentia. Is that are the numbers going up? I don't know. That's interesting. So it's uh, it's added a bunch of uh, sort of deadly sort of death and destruction related. Uh, oh yeah, the numbers are going up. It's like it's absorbing the radiation and uh, giving us more. Uh, of those of these sort of deadly uh, aspects. That's pretty cool. Ooh, it's got a different. Um, it's got like a different particle effect on it now. Is this going to get weirder over time? Well, so far, it doesn't seem so bad. I mean, I don't know how you could use this aura node because it's currently in an area infected with radiation. You'd have to get rid of the nuclear waste on the ground and then let the radiation subside before you could actually get over here and utilize this node. <laughs> I guess unless you very quickly bottled it up and took it with you. So the numbers are going up. I wonder if anything else is going to happen. Ha! <laughs> I should hit it with an EMP. That's cool, though. I don't remember what type of node these sparks mean that it is. It's cool. I like it. I wish I knew if something additional was supposed to happen. Because I don't want to cut it off and have something weird happen and miss it. But that's pretty neat. All right, so if you irradiate an aura node, it gets a bunch of uh, poison. Oh wait, oh it just changed. What kind of aura node is that? 
to I see I don't know. I forget what the um the types of nodes, I forget what the uh they look like. Doesn't doesn't look like a good good thing. It kinda looks like a, a bad thing. Looks like all the numbers are maxing out at thirty five. I wonder what will happen if when the potential gets to 35. Maybe something interesting. So it's definitely changing states. I wonder if it's going to start becoming hungry node. That's pretty neat. Is that sand going to keep bouncing on that ice forever? Alright, well we're getting up there. 27 potential. wonder if we throw out more nuclear waste, if that'll speed it up. <laughs> more radiation emitting things. It's neat. I wish I remembered what kind of node this is though. So is it's like a dark node or something? The evil node. I want to see what happens if, if anything happens when the potentia gets to 35. And then they're all at 35. I don't know. Maybe something will happen. I do really like how Rekka's mods tend to interact with uh, other things. Especially these Thaumcraft nodes. That's cool. So now we're up to 29, to 30. I just want to see if this changes state again. Because it's changed into, it started out as a normal node, and then it got those little sparks, whatever that meant. And now it's got this big, glowy, purple core. So that's pretty cool. Is it going to change again? I don't know. Trees are dying from the radiation. 31 potentia on this node. Come on, node. Be interesting. Some more. Do some more interesting things. Well, we're up to 35 on all the things. I guess maybe that's it. Maybe that's all it does. I don't know what kind of node this is. I don't remember. But it looks cool. So there you go. So if you irradiate in Thaumcraft or a node, it does take a while, but it'll gain. It still says 31 over there, but it says 35 on Wayla. It'll gain uh, venom, death, destruction, aura, taint, and power. That's cool. Alright. So there you go. And now hit it with an EMP, and crazy stuff will happen. <laughs> Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. I know it was a bit of a, a slow burn, but you know, if you're interested, uh, this is what happens if you irradiate a Thumbcraft or a node. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Um, I'll, I'll see you in the next video. I'm Satin Leach, and I'm signing out.